Go back to my edit. We'll trim this up so it's exactly one bar. So there you can see, uh, in terms of my start and my end time and the length, this is now one bar. Now, one other thing I want to show you is up under trim, I'm going to drop this into loop. So with the loop tool in engaged, I can now drag this out and it creates a loop. You can tell they're called loops because they have the little loop symbol after it. And uh, the great thing about loops is if I wanted to change anything in any individual clip, I can certainly, uh, it'll change in all of them. So. So here we can see some of these aren't exactly perfect. We can edit them so they are. Again, I'm going to switch my grid to a whole bar, make sure I'm in grid mode. Now, because I'm in grid mode, you can see that these are all locking to exactly the, the duration that I want. So now that's nice and tight. We have something to work with. Just want to increase my hi-hat level a little bit. You can also change the tuning 